D45 Tech Talk and the Smart Board Revolution Google Plus community presents a Smart Survival Guide. I'm your host, Matt Granger. This series is going to be about adding interactivity to lessons and simplifying lesson creation with widgets. There are going to be several in this series focusing on individual widgets at a time. This particular episode is about finding and installing the widgets. They don't come in the gallery by default. I'm not sure why, but they don't. Two ways of getting them. One way is to go to the Smart Exchange, exchange exchange.smarttech.com. You will have to sign in or create an account to be able to download. So if you don't have one, you'll have to do that. The easiest way to find them is to go here, browse by file type, and then select widgets. I would use this if I was looking for a particular one or I just wanted to look through and download just the ones that seemed interesting to me. So you see here at the bottom there are at least five pages. Now most of them are free. There are some that you have to pay for. Yes, it looks like there are five pages. So if there's a specific one that you see in these upcoming series about the widgets and you just want that one, you can come here and search for it as well. So if you knew the specific name, you can search for it and find it as well. That's one way of getting the widgets. Another way is to go to my page that has my smart board tutorial videos and some direction sheets and some other resources and one of the resources will be a gallery install item that already has all 52 of the widgets that I found as of May 2015. So there's the shortened URL will bring you to this page. You scroll down here on the right side in this adding interactivity to lessons section Right here, there's a section for widgets, and this will get longer as I add more of the videos. Find and install widgets, which is this video here, and then underneath that, here is the gallery install item. So when you click on that, it's going to download a file to your default download location, generally your downloads folder. When it finishes downloading, you'll have a file with an icon like this. To install it, You simply double click it, it will open notebook, and it will install here into the my content folder and create a folder called widgets 0515. Here are the directions. You click the widgets 0515 install file that you'll find in your downloads folder or desktop, wherever you save downloads to. After it's downloaded, you double click on it and it will open up Notebook if it's not already open. And in the My Content folder, it will create the Widgets 0515 folder for you. That's how you get them. It's that simple. One of those two ways. Go to the Smart Exchange if you just want individual ones. If you want all of them as of May 2015, get it from my site. And the address again goo.gl slash capital J zero lowercase z capital C capital H S. I'll also put that link in the description of this episode and you can click on it there.